ALSI has an AED function, so let's have a look at that in a bit more detail. I'm using the quick start scenario here, and I'm going to change the current mode to AED. I've also turned off any of the parameters that you can see here. So let's start the scenario. When we start it, you can see that the AED screen pops up. So let's turn that on. Attach pads. It asks you to attach pads. You can either do that by pressing the little animation there, or you can press confirm on the facilitator iPad. I'm going to just press this on the attach student screen. Pads. Once we get into this, it would ask you to press analyze. So that's what we're going to do next. Do not touch patient. Analyzing stand clear. So it's now analyzing a sinus rhythm. No shock advised. If no pulse, start CPR. So we can start CPR. And as we start doing that, we can also turn on the metronome. So that gives a really good guide for compressions for the student that you can use for teaching. Let's change the rhythm now to uh, VF, and we can use the virtual time to fast forward. And we're going to press Analyze again, but let's turn off the CPR and press Analyze. Do not touch patient. Analyzing stand clear. Shock advised. Charging. Do not touch patient. So it's recognized it as a VF rhythm. It's going to start charging. Now we're going to press the shock button. Start CPR. And we go back into CPR. So let's go back into the settings to see how we can change the functions of the AED. We're going to go into settings, and we're going to go into AED settings. We can auto-analyze yes or no, so we can turn that Analyze button off. We can have the metronome enabled from the start, so we can do that. And we can change the metronome rate. We probably should change that up to 110 now. What you can also do is all of the sounds that you hear, all of those voice prompts, you can actually change. So you can press in here, and it goes into the Sounds menu. Now, this is where you can record your own sounds, and it will actually change it to whatever voice prompts you actually want. You can also turn off the voice prompts as well. So you can turn off the Analyze voice prompt so it will not say it either. So you can really customize the AED for whatever your local settings are.